Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for the new moon. Um, so that would be the 3rd, June 3rd. So let's just see what comes up. I apologize for the delay, and if you have booked a private reading and it didn't get done tonight, I had something come up, and it will get done tomorrow during the day. So let's just see what happens for the third. We are going to start with this deck, obviously, because I put it in my hand. So what do we have for the third, for the new moon? Now, these dailies are for somebody. They're not for everybody. They're not sign-specific, so it may or may not be for you. Well, yikes. Okay, the Ace of Wands. This is, this is a new spark, a new flame, an exciting new opportunity. This is a new partner. <laughs> well, absolutely. New passionate beginning right here. It's like there's, a, there's an instant attraction of some sort. It's like the fire has been lit. Okay. I guess it's going to go right there in the middle. I mean, wow. That's all I can say is wow. It is. It's a wow. New passion. Okay, this is passion. The thinking man. Ooh. So we got this man that is thinking about offering something, or he's thinking about what he has to offer. He's thinking about giving something away. So yeah, we got a man that is thinking about, you know, what he has to offer, what he can give to a situation. One more card. Honeymoon. Enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. Now this is enjoy the bliss of a day together or a couple days together. Maybe then this is for the third. So maybe this is a day of in just enjoying time together with somebody. And this is a new spark, so I'm not sure if it's a new person or what, but hmm. This guy has a lot on his mind. He is thinking about, you know, everything. So, let's see what we got here. This is about spending time with somebody. A new, maybe it's a new attraction, a new flame. It could be rekindling a flame as well. Um, but that typically, to me, is a new partner. That's like a new, mm, a passionate beginning that has potential for growth, okay? It's exciting. So let's see, what else do we got for the third? Change, somebody's taking the next step. Oh, this is, a, this is wish fulfillment, this is a blessing. This is a dream come true, it's like a wish has been granted. Somebody may not be able to restrain themselves or, or you know, they've lost. This is loss of ambition, loss of focus, loss of control. Things may be a little out of control. This is chaos as well. So things may seem a little chaotic. Ooh, four of wands reversed. This is, a, this is good fortune. This is unexpected. This is, about, this is a relationship that is about to be more committed. So, yikes. King of Pentacles reversed. Hmm. Ah, the Hierophant. Ooh, 
Queen of Wands. We have a soulmate connection here. And it doesn't matter what sign. We have a soulmate connection here. Right, like just, I'm telling you what. This is an exciting, this is a very, you know, compatible couple. This one right here may, maybe they lack confidence, I don't know. Here, this is a very attractive individual who vibrates at a very high level. This person may feel like they don't have enough to offer. Hmm. A lot of passion here. Mmm, two of cups reversed. Queen of Swords, somebody's making a cut. Uh-oh, somebody is making a cut. Somebody has made a decision to, you know, take a new approach. I think we got somebody that has received some sort of clarity. Or they're seeing things from a new perspective. Ten of Pentacles. Now this is this is a new new beginning, a new stable, solid beginning, perhaps. It's like one something has ended because this is a completion. If somebody has been struggling or they I don't know, this could be a new relationship, this could be moving home, this could be having it all as well. This is this is an opportunity to have it all. I mean, this is like a richness. This is this is like having it all. Seriously. Whew. Now, this two of cups. We're gonna have to uh, clarify this. It's reversed. This is. It looks to me like this person. This is committing commitment. Faith. Having faith. I think we have somebody that is moving forward in faith. This is a change. We have a change here. This is a change. Somebody has been... Somebody's probably got to make a choice between two. This is a decision. A choice between two. Two people. Two partners. We have two kings and we have two queens. So we got somebody that has to make a choice now, a choice between two options, a cho choice between two paths. Which one is going to lead to stability? Which one is going to lead to security? Which one is going to lead to forever? Something long term. Somebody is, is deepening a bond here. And now it's about making a decision as to which one, you know, is going to be that dream come true, the wish fulfillment. Somebody has to make a cut. They have to make a choice. That's what we got here. A choice between two. <laughs> Absolutely. Now this is an upcom this is a celebration of some sort. Mm. Well, let's get some more cards. Giving deep thought. Somebody is giving deep, deep, deep thought to you know, who they want to commit to or who they want to move forward with. And in order to move forward with one, you know, you can't, you can't, you can't have both. So I think somebody, somebody has to go. There's a loss here. This is a lost opportunity. Somebody has made it, this Queen of Swords has made a decision to let something go. And I think because she may have been dealing with somebody who wasn't focused on something long term, this person, you know, hmm. this is a loss. This quick King of Pentacles reverse with the Ace of Pentacles. Somebody's lost a big, huge opportunity. This person has been giving deep thought to a relationship and may have realized that this person doesn't have good intentions. I mean. And 
that person's re somebody's reluctant to move in that direction, reluctant to move on, reluctant to take a new approach, reluctant reluctant to uh, transition into a new phase. Somebody has has been deceiving themselves. This is getting caught as well. Seven of Swords is getting caught. It's like the truth being coming out. I think we have somebody here that has realized the truth. It's like the truth is, is that. There's been some there's been some deception here. There's been some sort of lie or there's been some sort of sneaky shady or be, shady behavior and now it's time for a change. It is. It's time for me to bring this person. Somebody has made a decision to bring back to maybe work with somebody else. Now this is a card of patience, it's a card of divine timing, it's a card of purpose, there's a reason, there's a reason, this is a, there is a reason why things don't last, there is a reason why, you know, things fall away, there are, there are, there are reason, there's a reason why things don't manifest, there's a reason, there's a purpose. This is a blessing. A blessing is coming. There's there's some sort of blessing that is going to come out of let some sort of loss, okay? Cuz this is a loss. Somebody was being held back. They weren't letting change into their lives. You know, they were um maybe causing a person to go backwards because they were reluctant to make any moves or something like that. Mm. Yeah, we got somebody here that wasn't emotionally available. And we have this person that has made a decision to make a change. You know, it's, it's time for me to evolve. It's time for me to just maybe come together with somebody else. Giving up the fight. I think we got somebody here that is giving up the fight for somebody. Making a conscious change. I think we got somebody here that... Is moving in a new direction. I feel like there's been some sort of purging that has been going on. There's been some sort of... Um, awakening. And this is a rude awakening. Somebody's had some sort of rude awakening that it's time to let go. It's time to, it's time to break free from something that has been weighing them down. You know, it's time to experience some relief. It's time to, you know, go after my wish fulfillment. I think somebody has been really deceiving themselves. Seriously, with the Seven of Swords reversed and the Magician reversed, they've been deceiving themselves. Or... They've been dealing with a trickster. They've been dealing with a liar. They've been dealing with somebody who hasn't been telling them the truth. You know, and I think we, we feel, I feel like we have somebody here that is, has, you know, received some sort of divine guidance with, with this Hierophant card to not offer their heart to, you know, a false sense of security. It's time for a change. It's time to, you know, move forward. And let go of this false sense of security that, you know, has stolen your energy, that has held you down, that has caused you to lose your focus for so long. So I, f I feel like we have somebody here who's, who's, you know, receiving some sort of, this is a card of healing and this is a card of healing, some help or some healing from another person that is, This is slowly moving in a new direction. We have somebody here that has been grieving. They've been sad. They may have been in a state of depression. And I think that something that was started 
a while ago has now come to fruition, right? It's time to, this is a test. It's time to test the situation, whatever it is. Now this is a card of perseverance. It's almost like somebody's perseverance has paid off and now they're getting some sort of reward, some sort of blessing in some way. Somebody's receiving a stable offer from somebody, something that could lead to something long term. I think that this, there's definitely some divine timing there, here, okay? There is definitely some divine timing here. And I think there's a reason why somebody had some sort of loss or they didn't receive emotional fulfillment from somebody because the reason is is, is because there's a, there's a bigger wish here. There's a, this is a... a major new beginning. Endings bring new beginnings. Something had to end. Something had to go. Something didn't work out for a reason. This is the reason. The reason is, is that we have a major new beginning here with somebody that is, it's, it was, it's basically meant to be. It is definitely, I think it's meant to be. I think we got a soulmate connection here, seriously. Uh, and I think that this is something that has finally come to the point where it's time to come together you know there was a there was a period of time in between i think this is you know somebody planted the seeds and they nurtured them and they waited they waited for things to get be the right time they waited for things to grow they waited for you know whatever and now it's time there's no more it's time it is time it's time it's time for this new life. It's time for a new beginning. It's time to release what doesn't serve me. It's time to release the false of sense of security and, you know, go after all that is practical and real. I think we got a real opportunity here after somebody has been grieving, suffering, and holding on to some sort of dead end. It's like some sort of wish has been granted, and they got look at look it up at this new passionate beginning. I feel like we have a new passionate beginning here. We have a new fresh start with somebody. And I think it, there's just this new, new uh, instant attraction. I think this is instant. I think there's an, I do, I do feel like this is an instant attraction. And um, it's, it's, it could be a past life connection. It could be a past life connection. It, it, it's, it's a chance to, this is a chance to, um, basically have it all seriously this is this is your wish is granted your wish is granted i mean that's all that i can think of i mean judgment day this is we 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 i can't even hardly speak this is an awakening. Some sort of some somebody's had some sort of epiphany that it's time to live again. Somebody ha is releasing the past. That's that's what this is. Somebody is releasing a past that they have been holding on to, and they're moving in a new direction towards a new passionate beginning with somebody. We have a new spark here. We have a new flame. We have a. I think there's 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 just. some sort of a blessing that comes out of the blue that leads somebody down a new path and it's 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 almost like it's, it's shocking it's going to lead to victory and success it is the six of wands as is victory and success it's progress being made Some sort of secret that has been hidden. If it's, it's something that has been hidden below the surface, whatever. I don't even need the moon card to see that. <laughs> it's coming out. Okay, it's coming out. It's like you can't. 
you can't hide the truth of whatever this is. It's like the time is now. It's, the time is now to come together with whoever this is. Like I said earlier with this purging, somebody has purged the past or they've been working on purging the past and now it's time to come together with <coughs> the one that you deserve, the one that is going to give equally to you, the one that is, you know, going to help to bring balance to your life. This is giving and receiving. This is, this is, you know, an equal opportunity, put it that way. So we have somebody here that is moving in a new direction, and I feel like they're moving very quickly. I think there's very fast, rapid movement here. I think the time is now. The time is now to, you know, reap the rewards of something that was planted a long time ago. It's like now it's it's come to the point where it's it's time. It's time to chest check. It's time to check. Or it's time to I was gonna say check the ripeness of it. Is it is this it? Is is this what it was all what I thought it was gonna be? Um We have a major new beginning here. And this is after releasing the past. This could be a reconciliation with somebody, you know. It could be a reconciliation with somebody that you've known before. Somebody that you, you know, have a past life connection with. It was written in the stars. Somebody is going to be receiving communication from somebody. This is communication. And I think this communication is coming from somebody that, you know, there may have been a delay. There may have, because it took time. It took time to get to, you know, fruition. It took time to manifest. It took time to get to where it was time. You know what I mean? So I feel like there's some sort of major, serious, major change here. Okay, we got a serious, major change here that is happening. Somebody's headed in a new direction. And with these sixes, this is about headed in the right direction. They're headed and somebody's headed in the right direction, right towards balance, right towards harmony. Right towards peace. This is, this is a, a situation that can bring peace and healing it's like to your soul. The moon on the bottom. Now doesn't that make sense? This is Pisces or Cancer. Something that has been hidden is about to come. It's coming to the surface. It's not. I don't even think it's. I think it's already at the surface. That surface. I think it's above the surface. I think it's. Uh, it's clear. I do. I think it's clear. I do believe that somebody's had some sort of awakening. They've received some sort of clarity. So they've accepted some sort of truth. And I feel like we have a, a major new beginning here that is it's life changing. Seriously. This is, this is the rods of love. This, these, so, you know, I feel like we got somebody here that may have not been prepared for love but they may become obsessed this is obsessed they may be obsessed with what is this this is obsessed Resisting change. Scared. Somebody may have been in isolation for some time and now maybe they're, they're, they may be fearful or they may not have the... Well, they might go off track every once in a while.
This guy has made a decision. He has made a decision. Probably not to go back to something. We have love here. I think we have a, a huge offer of love. I think there's there's love. There's love. There's tender loving care. I think this guy is is has made a decision to communicate with or, or to work with this person who is readily available. I mean, this person is ready for love. She has a lot of love to offer. You know, he may get distracted. I think we have this. This is the thinking man right here. We have this thinking man that may not think he has enough to offer. It goes right back to that. He, he, this guy may not think that he has enough to offer. But she's looking for love. She's looking for love. So I think that we have a message coming in. Or some forward movement. That is, is changing a person's direction rapidly. There's rapid change of direction here. One more card. <laughs> La first card, last card. I can't make it up. First, I just said one more card. That was the very first card. Now it's the last card. This is a passionate new beginning. This is a new partner. A new sexual partner, a new partner that could that could grow into something. This is exciting. It's 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 instant and it's mutual. It's mutual attraction. It's instant attraction. This is an equal opportunity where both people actually feel the same. Oh God, I got to show you what's on the bottom. The Empress. She is, she's the goddess of love. She's nurturing, she's caring. She has a lot of strength, strength. She's very compassionate, she's sensual, she knows her worth, she's beautiful, she's a beautiful soul. And now, I mean, she gives birth to a miracle. She she's, gives birth to a new life. She nurtures everything. So we have a new life here. The struggle, I think the struggle is over. It is definitely a soulmate connection. I am going to see. It is. I think that we have, There's. there's been some sort of distance. There's been some sort of insecurities in between these people coming together. And there probably will be. The biggest problem will be insecurities. Am I good enough? But this is truly a soul, two soulmates coming together. They can help each other. There's, there's, there may have been some uh, lapse, lapses in communication. You know, there may have been some periods of time where somebody was left out in the cold or somebody ghosted another person. But, you know, I think that somebody is coming back around or they're, 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 it's, the time is now to work on this what partnership, whatever it is that was meant to be. It totally, 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 totally is meant to be. But I feel like this is a, I, I honestly feel like this is somebody brand new. This is the birth of a new life. It really states that because the false sense of security is going bye-bye with the tower card. It's like this new attraction is so vibrant, okay? It's so vibrant. There's, it's, it's so 
attractive that it's undeniable. I mean, it's un, it's like you can't even restrain yourself from it. Anyway, we're not going to keep going. Um, we have a new passionate beginning here between two people that are absolutely positively meant to be. And I can't make that up for any reason whatsoever. Good luck. 